three. All right, everybody, I'm with Jorge Sanchez at Hocho's Tacos, one of my favorite spots on West Lewis, 510 West Lewis in the heart of Pasco. Man, Jorge, good to be with you, man. How's everything going before we get started? Uh, everything's good. Uh, we're going to cook today. We're going to make one of the one of our famous um, dishes, which is the, uh, the alambre. The alambre, man. I can't wait. I've been hearing about this. So yes. tell us about it. Ingredients is bell pepper, onion, um, bacon, all cooked with all grilled with the meat. Oh, that and we top so it on with, And then we top it on with mozzarella cheese. And it's one of the favorite dishes in this place. So this flies out here. Let's get going, man. Okay, I'm gonna throw, but it, it, it goes on the steps. You gotta throw the bacon first. Oh, who doesn't love, everybody loves bacon. Yeah, absolutely. All people love bacon. Oh man, that bacon smells so good. What's the meat? What kind of meat is this for? That me? is beef. So straight beef? Beef. Yeah, put a little bit of salt. A little bit of seasoning. Yeah. And the thing here, we don't use any oil here. So no oil. We don't use. Juice. What does that help? Does that help kind of with the flavor and just keep the authenticity of it? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the authenticity of the, of the meat and the right. bacon. Combined with the, with the bell pepper and the meal on it, it tastes really good. That's true, because I think everybody's uh, guilty of putting too many uh, <laughs> ingredients on their meat this time. Now we have to do some. Can make tortillas? Okay, so here's the tortillas. Oh man, it does look fresh and... I just pre-press it. You guys press these yourselves, huh? Yeah, we press them ourselves. I have a pre-press, so I don't yeah, have to be pressing right. at this moment enough at this time. Oh man, that looks so good. Look at that. Oh, you got a move Oh right. And while you're cooking, talk about your window a little bit because that's really helped out business, right? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, we used to be just a regular restaurant where people come in to go into the lobby. Now we put the, the pepper and the onion. Oh. Yeah, people used to come to the main bowl and order, have a seat, have a seat, and we take their order and we take the food to the order. But now with the, yeah, with COVID, with the, with the, with the COVID thing, yeah. uh, we have to figure something out. So we have an, a, a window. We have a window where people can order right off the street. Right. And uh, as people say, it's touchless. Yeah. It helps a lot. Yeah, that's good. That's good to hear. It's helping with the same time you even have a lot of delivery drivers that will come by and pop in. Oh man, that's so good. 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 Oh man, that's so so the flavor is starting to come out. Ready. So we're just gonna put it like that and throw it on the plate. Like that. Now we're gonna top it up with mozzarella cheese. A mozzarella cheese on the top. Oh, wow. So it melts on top of it. Make some. 